working from home. Add to cart. Online shopping. Lunch delivered. Groceries shipped. Just the essentials. No coworkers, no commute, no pants. I loved it. This is Michaela from Account. Until one stupid conference call with a research scientist. The results conclusively determined that having few friends led to a higher incidence of clinical depression. Scared me shitless. Our multi-center study sought to determine whether there was a correlation. Uh, hi, social... Nola Copywriter here. What does that actually mean? Someone without close friends is likely to be fatter and die younger. What? Come on. I have friends. I don't see them very often. But I like their photos. Deliver his lunch every weekday. Shwarma. Extra spicy, extra onions. Juan? Is everything okay with your falafel place downstairs? Your neighbor, Hugo Wambach, he died a few days ago. What? You didn't notice the packages sitting in the hallway for days? Or the smell is why I called the cop. No. Um, how did he die? It seems to be natural causes. Oh, he was old. No, young guy, about 35. Appears to have been a freelance graphic designer. We're looking for next of kin or friends, but it doesn't really seem like he had any. Oh, sorry, your lunch is late. Do you want this too? No charge. I have friends. Hey, you've reached Nikki. I'm at a week-long silent yoga retreat, so I... This is Maggie. Ringers on silent, so it doesn't wake the baby. I had friends, yes. Don't leave a voicemail unless you're pregnant, engaged, or someone died. What up, bitches? I'm busy, and who calls on the phone? Why did I just send that? My husband, Nick, he's always there. So I'm thinking Korean burritos after hockey practice tonight. At least he used to be. Bring on the kimchi, brah. Yeah, brah. Bring it on. And if I'm desperate, I can turn to my big sister. Hey, I can't talk long. We're testing out new color flavor combinations for our new edible lip gloss. This will only take a minute. I just need some advice. What's up? How can I make new friends? OMG lols, Instagram, it's so easy. You just gotta pick the right hashtag. No, I mean real live friends. Oh, we'll go to a yoga class. Ask the girl on the mat next to you to go out for kale smoothies after. Ta-da! I don't do yoga, and I don't know which sounds worse, kale or smoothies. Run and brush through your hair. Put on a little lip gloss. Look, people are nicer to people who look nice. Put together. But I'm not, it's false advertising. So are Spanx. Put some of those on too. Just get out of the house ASAP, okay? All right, I gotta go. Love you. Bye. Bye. Look, send my sister the emergency pack. You don't overnight it. She's desperate. Oh, bye. <laughs> Have fun. What do you think, banana? So, here I am. Out at a bar, meeting new people. I get it. Working from home, hours will go by, and I haven't moved. Right? <laughs> Thank you. So what do you do? Um, a uh, writer? Advertising mostly. Oh, like commercials? Yeah. Have you seen the new shingles vaccine commercial? The stick figure man making eggs? <laughs> I, I wrote that one. Vaccines cause autism. No, they prevent diseases. <laughs> I read that the side effects are worse than the diseases. Get your science from scientists. This disease causes blisters and burning and permanent nerve damage. Vaccines cause permanent nerve damage. Whatever. Get shingles. Check, please. I'm glad you went out, but I can't be the only person you talk to. I can. I mean, I love you, but new friends, good. Uh, that is easy for you to say, Mr. My coworkers made me hockey team captain tonight. You are raking in the work friends right now. <laughs> You'll be better next time. 
Next time. Mm-hmm. Oh God, there's gonna be a next time. Mm -hmm.